Okay, party people, here we go for a very windy run number 32. We have 22 knots of wind. Okay, let's just see if she just rumbles up to speed. We did 44 knots at, with that sort of rough seas with the big rudder down without even any flare. Oh, she's got grunt. She's got grunt. This is a world record breaking day. This, this boat can do it. This boat can do it. Awesome. Woo! in uh, Warbus Bay, looking at going out for run 48. It's quite good breeze today, it's 20 knots, probably gusting to 21. Really good conditions, we've got the same setup as we had yesterday, and uh, we're hoping for a 40 knot plus run and do the first 40 knot average. So, uh, we seem to be lucky so far on Tuesdays. Today's a Tuesday, so let's see if we can't turn it into top speed Tuesday. the rim. <laughs> Say something, I nearly killed you. Okay, uh, party people, well, that was a little bit on the wild side, that run. I was using full rudder to, full skeg steering to turn away and the boat wouldn't turn away. Uh, I went inside the rim that was standing on the shallow part of the beach. Normally, if the beach is here, the rib is here, I go past here. I went up and just missed the rib. We hit 42.2 knots. Oh, we still have control issues. Yes. Yes, yes, still have control issues. Okay, turning up under the course, flat plunge is engaged, flat down, rudder release, forward bridle up, everything is on, 3, 2, 1, event. Come on, get up there, we need full lock on the rudder, hand steering is ready to roll, eyes are down.
Okay, get the bow. Let's get the bow. Get in the back of the boat. Yeah. Yeah, I just can't see if there's lines. Uh, what's that? Oh, the after landing surface. No, it's not Well, that wasn't, uh, that wasn't what we wanted. Okay, just go. Run 50. Okay, I'll put it backwards. I bet you if I said to Malcolm, guess what happened, I bet you he wouldn't guess what Run 53. I had a nice neutral feeling on the helm. It felt very slippery. Uh, the rudder, the steering, the wing angles, everything felt really, really sweet. So uh, much better than on the last run. Similar top speeds. So um, we're definitely dialing the boat in the right direction, which is what we want to see. But uh, I'm pretty happy with the result of that. We'll go back with this information. Feed it to Malcolm. If Malcolm's happy, I'm happy and uh, we're laying a good foundation for a higher speed. So uh, very clean run, nice straight 500, flat, no spray. We're ticking a few boxes off here. So as long as she all holds together, we should be ready for a big run.